Senator Padilla has filed a resolution urging an, inv an investigation into the suspension of SMNI. The senator is questioning whether the suspension violates press freedom. He argued that public access to information on matters of public concern is essential for democratic decision-making. Padilla also cited a court ruling that highlighted the crucial role of press freedom in safeguarding free speech and expression. He also criticized the National Telecommunications Commission, or NTC, for allegedly failing to provide sufficient justification for SMNI suspension. Well, in courtesy, kasi, <laughs> kasi oh. the, first of all, how are you going to do this? Kasi alam naman natin, hindi lang naman ang uh, NTC ang involved dito, pati yung lower house. They're involved in investigating the SMNI uh -huh. and whether or not i -re revoke the... Okay, parang or, may, ano ngayon, quiet eh, no? Deadlock yun. Eh, uh, quiet. So, parang inter-parliamentary courtesy, how is he going to question congressmen aside from... Uh, alam, na, alam naman ang lahat na nagsimula yung... sa lower house oh, yan. Lower house. So how will you Pupunta then question? Pupunta ba oh, ang Congress? Oh. The last time they questioned the congressman, it was because of charter change. Nagkaroon ng issue. Oh, oh. Nagkainitan yung dalawang Kasi side. Supposedly Number two, uh, what happened to ABS-CBN? Mm -hmm. Diba? I mean, what happened to press freedom there? We all know naman what happened, diba? Oh, pero yun nga, sinasabi natin, maraming opinion dyan dahil sinasabi nangyari sa mga iba pang mga Uh, ang tawag to, mga media networks during the Duterte administration na tinira. Uh, I think it's a bad precedent also dahil alam naman din natin ang kinu-question nila yung pinagsimulan nito dahil mm -hmm. sa supposedly false information sa travel funds ni uh, Speaker, Speaker. Yes. Martin Rapwal. Oh, uh.